Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Brian Mustafa and I believe in you and I believe in the power of your dreams. If you are new to this channel, uh, subscribe, follow, whatever it is like. Daily I bring out videos to teach you about digital marketing, public speaking and a lot. So if you are new, just go ahead and like, subscribe to this channel and let's move on. So today we are going to look at how to create fresh Pinterest pins that go viral. So if you are new to Pinterest, it's a great place that you can easily market your products and services. So I use Pinterest to market my affiliate markets uh, pro products. You can see I have close to like 16,000, 16,000 uh, monthly viewers and I only have 60 followers. That's surprising because I keep on putting pins and people get to notice them. Even though they don't follow me, but Pinterest is a search engine in a way social media but a search engine optimized in a way to let people see your pins even if they are on what uh, google they can still find your pins and follow you so you can see great performance of my pins so there are great pins that you want to create and how do you do that so maybe you want to create pins fresh pins like this you can see different great great pins and you need to use that to market your products or services any type of product you have you can market that on pinterest so let's go straight we are using canva to create that those pins so if you are new to canva just hit so, so sign up or login if you already have an account like me just log in and you are good to go you can log off google facebook or even apple so i'm just logging with my facebook and I'm pretty sure i'm here so you also see this interface and you decide if you just go want to create a fresh pin if you know the margins if you know the size that's okay if you don't just type in here pinterest pins so pinterest in the search box pins and the beauty of it is that you are going to get different templates from different people who've designed great pins that you can just rely on if you see a pin that relates to your business just we change make changes to that and you are good to go so you can see great pins some of the pro version and uh, some just free you can just edit them and keep moving so i'm just going to i'm using the pro version so there's a link to this description if you sign up to this you can use the 30-day free description or uh, free pro pro for 30 days for free and uh, you are good to go but then if you are not doing anything serious uh, and serious designs the pro version the free version is okay the free version is okay and uh, you are easy to go with that so let's go straight to create fresh pins and now uh, we just want to create new fresh pins and we are good to go with that so once you click you see the dimension the dimension is a uh, it's just straight and they'll give you the dimension which is like thousand by thousand five hundred pins uh, pixels and that's the right dimension that has been what recommended by Pinterest so you can bring in your images here you can bring in text but then I uh, download my images from uh, two places or three places creative fabrica where you can get great images and also you can go to pixabay Dot com so creative fabric i've left the description is uh, the link is in the description where you can go and get your text of uh, files images if you are doing kdp publishing if you want fonts you can get them there and also creative market i get uh, images there but then i just come here and i search in for maybe uh, let me say laptop because i want to do a pain about uh, affiliate market so make money from home or like this so this is a great pin a great image that I can just pick and use because I want to uh, let's do a pin about how to write a blog and you can see this talks about it very well so I just download it you can use it commercially free download and that uh, free for commercial use and personal use no attribution just download it and bring it on to the Pinterest the playing area where you want to do your design so now i'm going to upload it but then you can equally get photos here on the canva platform they have also templates photos that you can just rely on and use but then i prefer 
getting my own photos even though there are relatively both images here too but then let me import it what I just downloaded so it's here and I'm good to go so you see it here this area so this is the area that you talk about your own images videos audios that you've reported in even text uh, fonts and different things you can see them here so now that we have our, our image here let's just import it in click it up once and it is here so I'm just going to you align this I want it to fill here and uh, like this wait I want right I want it this way so that the laptop will appear and uh, the cap will also appear so we're going to, going to do a pin that talks about how to uh, create Pinterest pin or how to just give it a topic so what we'll do is that you may just leave it like this and write something on it but then just to give it some little visibility and give it go to elements try to bring in some shapes when a circle shape you can just bring in this type of shape and uh, make it stylish so that once you write on it people will be able to watch know that uh, you've also done something that's uh, worth talking about something that is great so I want to do this stylish something I'm just trying something so once it is here you can uh, change the color of it to right and uh, let's write uh, let's import bring text in just text we're going to do how to to create viral Pinterest pins how to create viral viral Pinterest pins so we have it here but then you can see that the text is not that sweet so we just explore different texts text structures to see which one will actually fit our brand or which one do we think we can use to be able to what uh, portray whatever we want to talk about so the text the pins too or the fonts too you can import your own font and also some of them are pro and the free versions we are good to go with them so I'm going to look for some font so just go through okay so I like this font because that is thick and it portrays maybe what uh, I just want so how to create fire out things so let's change the color for the color of the font it's too blur right it's too just change it and make sure that it matches of whatever you want or whatever design you are trying to portray so and also look at look out for your your company colors so if you have a company preference colors you can go with that so pretty much I am done with this and uh, the pen is okay and I can add different pens to this just go here and do duplicate so once I duplicate this you can just work with this and uh, this another font this another design and I can change this if we give this one a different uh, image and uh, make sure I bring in some different text structure whatever makes you feel like this is this is the pin that you see so when you look at Pinterest like it needs visibility they must see your pins must be visible for people to see so like this one the seven best amazing KDP niches you can see that they are thick and they can easily see them so if you are creating pins make sure that you look at that so this one maybe you will just uh, you know, how to create viral increase the text size you can just drag it to increase so you go here to increase it and also make sure that it's straight it's aligned to whatever you want to do and uh, so this one let's see what we can do let's see how we can change this
get a different text, nice text, to be able to work with this. Right, so I just wanted to see, bring something in, go to the elements, go to maybe bring some, like something different into this, incorporate something so that you can hold on to it and it's going to be visible. So let me bring in the same text box, I'm going to bring in the state text box. And I want to make sure that the Pinterest is a little bit flashy. And uh, so once it's like this, simply means that the text or whatever is like in front of it. So I'll bring this, click on this. I just want to click on it and do position. I want to bring it forward so that it will be in front of the text so that I can work with that. Picking the two. So let me just do. So I want to pick the text alone. I want this one to go here. And I uh, want to see the text. Okay. So it's covering it, but I can do the transparency so that it will be like this. Then now I can change the position to go to the back so that you see that it's been highlighted so you can uh, also change the color to make sure that if the color is not the highlighted color is not visible you can work with that to make sure that you get the best out of it so you can introduce different shapes you can introduce different colors you can even go and bring because we're talking about pinterest why don't we bring pinterest logo to it so just type in pinterest on the elements and you see that a logo will come and you'll be able to use that logo so you can even bring a pinterest logo to, to it you can bring in uh, like a facebook logo you can get all of them here if you don't get them here trust me you can get them on the pixel uh, pixel bay to download for free so you can introduce the friend elements and bring them here so once we are done with this what we need to do is so this is the first one and this is the second one they are all pretty much the same like the same so let's change this color a little play with it play with it until you get and since we are talking about the Pinterest position backwards since we are talking about pinterest let's see how best we can change this color so that it, it will reflect like uh, pinterest colors and uh, we'll work with that can work with this so make sure that this position forward so that I can place it well. Right, then you position it backwards again. And uh, it's been backed two times. Okay, so now it's okay. And uh, you can make sure that it's still visible. Change the frame, play with it. Change this, you can change this uh, image. You can just introduce another image, uh, maybe laptop. to bring it to whatever like you can get even great mockups so let's bring this laptop in this image make it big send it to the back position position it back until everything is on top of it and you can edit it and you can even make it like a, an animated image and this this will help you get more visibility on pinterest so you can animate everything that are ready so once you are done all you can do you can do share design or you can just download it or you can uh, pretty much 
uh, just send it straight to send it straight to Pinterest. So you can download it here. You can just do Pinterest, and uh, you connect. You ask you to connect your Pinterest to it. Now, once you connect your Pinterest to this, once I give this access, I'm going to be able to share my Pinterest pins direct from Canva to Pinterest. So you put the title, you put different bots. You see, these are all the bots I have. There are a lot of bots, more bots to this than that. So you choose a bot, and once you choose a bot, then you choose write a title. Then you write uh, maybe the description. Go to Pinterest, get ideas. Type whatever you want, get ideas. Go to people's pins. You get to see the type of keywords they are using and tags they are using to get more visibility. You copy them if they are related to your niche. Then you bring them in under your title, description, and title. You create all this and straight you just publish. And you publish this straight to Pinterest. So if you are new to this, thank you for the time. And I believe that this one may help somebody. And you can do 10, 100 uh, different pins, and you can just get visibility doing these pins. So make sure that you learn how to design them, use your own templates, create your own templates if you have time like we do. If you don't have time, you can just go to templates and choose someone's template and remodify it just replace it with someone's template you can see it's nice and uh, you can just change the names uh, and work with that change the names change the colors I'm just putting my name here so my name yes my name is here but uh, if i want the text i just continue with it if I don't want the design, the color, uh, change the color to blue or something like this. So this one, you can edit the image. This, if you don't like it, you just kick it out. 40% off. I don't have any 40% off, so I kick it out. I make it free. That's the power of me. Then this one may not be part of my brand. You can bring it out and introduce something else then do different tests with that and you pretty much you are good to go once you're done share you can just download it uh, here download it as a, a png or download it as jpeg or even if you want pdf print you can download it and uh, easy to go and you can work with that so thank you for your time if you are new to this channel please subscribe like and let's move on but pretty much this is how you create viral pins and uh, do your researches leave a comment if there's something you want me to do for you leave a comment let's partner let's do more thank you for your time